Hello everyone, Max Knight here. Let's continue playing Shining Force 2. Um, well, we do really need healing still. Um, let's take a chance, shall we? Kill the Death Monk! He's still healing the Death Archer. Thank you. I can kill this Death Monk a lot easier if he's not healing himself. That's awesome. Um, very good. Very good. Attack Jaha, because Bowie did, was not already damaged. That really hurt. And Slade kills the Death Monk. Um, okay. So I realize that there are times when I'm not talking a whole lot in this, and that's mostly because, for some reason, I can't think of anything to talk about. But, uh... I actually have something to talk about now. Some people don't, uh, who've never played this game before, you know, or don't understand the different concepts and whatnot, are, um, are just may, may want to, uh, actually vote in the whole who do I take at Creed's Mansion thing. So, um, let me just explain what the four choices are. The four choices in this, when you get to Creed's Mansion, are to take, uh, a centaur knight named Eric, who is generally considered one of the best um, in the game. He can be promoted to either a, uh, a Pegasus Knight or a Paladin, depending on wh when I get him, when I promote him, and who gets the uh, actual special promotion item. He can be... Uh Man, I want to move him away. Let's see, he can... Uh well, there's really not much about him. I mean, by the time you get to Creed's Mansion, you'll already have two Centaur Knights. And so, you know, having a third one may feel kind of... Uh, it may feel kind of redundant to have one. But, you know, that's just kind of how it works. Um, next up, uh, second choice is Randolph, a warrior like Jaha who, in general, becomes the best warrior. Jaha tends to have higher defense. Uh, Randolph tends to have higher... Uh, have higher attack. And I think I just won this battle. Oops. Uh, doubles. Okay. Let's, let's keep moving into, into Bado. Uh, anyways. Randolph makes an excellent choice to uh, promote to Baron. Jaha makes a better gladiator than a Baron, typically, so... That's what I was originally intending to uh, to do, and uh, if I get more votes for Randolph, I can probably take him. But you know, once again, that's up to you guys. Um, let's see, the uh, third choice being Tyrion, a mage, kind of like Kazin, only he earns all of the different uh, types of magic uh, in the er, the damaging kind, typically uh, blaze, freeze, bolt, and the sleep spell. Which doesn't usually get much use. Um, typically, there that typically makes him a stronger wizard than a sorcerer. But as a sorcerer, he also earns the most. Um, he earns the most, uh, or all of his spells earlier, I should say. Let's see what do you guys say, please. There was a greater devil here. Um, shoot, it's, it's hard to keep on the same thought here. Okay, yes, the face is dark inside, thank you. Um, let's see. Ooh, weapon shop. What do you sell? Got that. Ooh. Ooh! Hey! Everyone's got new weapons except for Bowie. That's awesome. I only have one centaur for the moment. Uh oh. Um, sell Jahasma hand axe. Um, Tyrion earns his uh, sorcerer spells earlier than uh, 
the other possible sorcerers than Kazen does and a future sorcerer that we pick up. Um, generally making it uh, a good choice for him. Uh, but most people like to keep him as a wizard because he earns all of the different regular um, all the different regular damage spells in comparison. Dang on it, even Slade's hands are full. Sell his uh, dagger. Final choice is Karna, a priest like Sarah, only she earns the Aura spell, which is a multi-target healing, uh, and the Boost spell, which increases attack and or increases defense and agility, I should say. Uh, a few things to keep in mind um, when you're uh, choosing who to pick is that Karna and Tyrion are the ones to be the easiest to gain levels later on in the game when we can pick up the other three that we that we missed the first time. And the reason for this is because, no matter what level you are, magic does the same amount of damage. Whereas, in uh, the other characters, the more physically aligned characters, will have a more difficult time keeping up, uh, or getting up to speed, I should say. Anything in here? No. I wish it would stop checking things twice like that. Um, okay. Okay, I'd like to stop talking to things more than once. Anything in here? Quick ring! Ooh! Increases agility, I think. Um, let's see. I'm trying to say, uh, Karna is a, uh... I don't want to pass an iron arrow. Karna is a... Who has the lowest agility of everyone? Peter, Kiwi, or Jaha. Item, equip. Equipping with this. Okay. I like to keep, you know, the same thought. I don't know why I keep getting off track here. Um, is there anything? Maybe after the, all the uh, scenes and whatnot. In fact, before I go on with these scenes, I'll uh, I'll stop the video simply because I don't have all that much more time. Um, I forgot to look at the time again. Uh, there was just one one other thing I wanted to uh, to mention um, is that for a priest to uh, use her her special uh, promotion item, the Vigor Ball, you actually uh, or you can find two of them in the game. One relatively early in comparison before you get to Creed's, one much later in the game, and it, if I took Karna, I would probably be either giving her the Vigor Ball or promoting her to Vicar pretty early, because I'm not about to keep a Priest around for the entire game, just to find the second Vigor Ball. It's either one or the other at, this time, with, at that point. And like I was saying, it's much easier to raise a Priest, especially one that knows the boost spell, and a Mage who has magical damage that won't be uh, gimped by his level. In comparison to the other two, uh, Tyrion, or no, not Tyrion, Randolph and uh, Eric, whose damage will depend much more on his attack rating, their attack rating, and their weapon, which won't be able to do much unless they promote. So, just to keep that in mind, in case you want to make, and I'd really like to get some extra votes, a co-worker of mine who's interested in this, has been watching it for some time, gave me a vote for, who was it, uh, for Tyrion, no, uh, no particular Terran, but just a vote for Terran. So, uh, count that one for Terran, one for Randolph, one for Eric. And uh, I will cut this video off now, and I will uh, see you.